So hello guys welcome back to the channel in this video we'll cover this amazing lab so first of all click on start lab and open the cloud console in incognito window now first of all many of you were asking how to enable the check my progress you can check the description i've shared that video too so just start the lab and sometimes you may be asked to enter the username and password always check the lab instruction for it now here click on i understand here click on i agree and then agree and continue now just click on this top button it will basically activate your cloud shell we'll be using cloud shell for performing all the labs in this course now just click on continue and authorize yourself now in the description box of this video i've shared one github repository i'll show you you have to just copy from here and just paste on the cloud shell now what it will do let's explore so basically first you will set the install structure and then it will deploy the application and after that it will create a sync and for the buckets we have to create it ourselves so just wait for all the tasks to complete it will take some time and you need to wait until the cloud shell is off basically cloud shell tasks are completed so let's wait here you have to click on this second url okay now basically here we'll be creating the bucket so let me show you how we have to create the bucket now for the bucket name you have to come back to the lab instructions and copy from here first of all if you want to check the score you will get the score for first and last task only the second task which is create a log bucket we have to do it manually so let me show you how you have to create this so for that you need to just copy the bucket name from number three okay just copy it without any extra space and dot just paste over here come down click on upgrade and create a new bigquery data set make sure you have enabled those two now just copy the data set name paste over here now no need to make any other changes just click on create if it asks to update the region it will be updated currently there is no so we are using the default values so just click on create so now as you can see it has been created now sometimes you won't get the score instantly so you need to wait for some time and after that we'll definitely get the score wait for some time and you'll get the score and do like the video and subscribe the channel 